New details tonight in the brutal murders of three people. Yes, it happened in Palmdale, and investigators say the killer is still on the loose. CBS News' Andrea Fujii is live in Palmdale, where there was a vigil held for the family tonight. Andrea? Pat and Rick, investigators say the suspect lived on this property with the three victims, and it was inside this house where they say he brutally killed them and their three dogs. Richard Gardner III was known for riding his bike all over the Antelope Valley, hauling his trailer that carried supplies for his window washing company. This is a commercial for it. I clean windows. Dozens of friends and family shared their stories about the 52-year-old and his dad and stepmom, who were all murdered in their Palmdale home January 12th. My brother was a very wonderful person who had a lot of trials in his life. They never stopped him. He was so positive. Richard's sister says their dad, Richard Gardner Sr., was bedridden at age 78. His wife, 56 year old Pepper Gardner, and Richard Jr., took care of him. She says Richard always made sure he made time for his dad. He just wanted to prove himself to everybody that he could do all the things that he wanted to, and he had such great plans to do that he's not able to complete them now. Investigators say James Todd Brown rented space on the Gardner's property for his trailer. There was some type of argument, and investigators say he killed all three. The victims were were stabbed, suffocated, and beaten. Their three dogs were also bludgeoned to death. Investigators believe Brown got away in this 2002 silver Toyota pickup. There's now a warrant out for his arrest. Friends and family say they'll always remember Richard Jr. riding his bike with a big smile. He was never angry at anybody. That's why this, this situation doesn't make any sense. Investigators say the suspect has a history of domestic violence and do consider him armed and dangerous. Pat and Rick, back to you.